place your fate in her inexperienced hands as she tries to work through her daddy issues by fixing you. Here we offer fun things such as somewhat functional staff and 24-hour pest control. Custom rooms and just look at this turkey parlor. It didn't explain anything about how we're trying to save demons from extermination, which is the whole fucking point. Vaggy is right, Alistair. The commercial was to let sinners know we are trying to help them. Well, my dear, I haven't been active in hell for some time, and everyone remembers me from my radio show, the proper medium to express oneself. But you insisted on this noisy picture box advertisement, so I had a little fun with it. Oh, fun? You had a little fun with it? Well, this is not what we want to represent us. When you showed up here a week ago, you told us you would help run this hotel. Instead, you're mocking us. Nobody's gonna want to come to a place that a powerful overlord like you thinks is a waste of time. We are making a new commercial, one that represents her vision and what we're doing here. So, we need a camera. Alistair? A video camera? Uh. All right, let's do this. <laughs> Please! <laughs> oh, Alistair, I think he's had enough! Nah, he's got a few more hits in him. <laughs> Thanks for another forgettable experience. Thank you for letting your guard down. Oh, ah, ah, shit. <laughs> well, it looks as though I need a visit to the tailor. Best of luck, chums. And here's the sugar on the cream. He asked me to join his team. Oh, no. I said no, and now he's busy. That's the tea. You I'll show you suffering. Uh-oh, the TV is buffering. I'll destroy you! I'm afraid you've lost your signal. How art thou? It has been an age since thou hast graced us with thy presence. Some have spun wild tales of you fall into holy arms. <laughs> I just took a well-earned sabbatical, nothing serious. Though it's fun to keep everyone on their toes. <laughs> <laughs> there too hath been rumor of thy involvement with the princess and her recent flight to fancy. Tell me, how dost thou fall in such folly? That is for me to know. But please, do guess. I'd love to know the theories. So, as I was saying, we need to discuss... Yes? On the subject of discussion. <laughs> oh, tasty. Mega proof. It's a dead fucking exorcist. I'd say that's pretty fucking definitive. You going blind, old man? We know not how this perished. Mayhaps twas not by a demon's hand at all. If we rush to war without knowing mightn't, they purge all of hell for daring and uprising. It could happen. Oh, that's right, that's possible. True. That's, true. Oh, that's possible, know. I suppose. Who needs a bus boy now that you got the chef? Oh, fuck you, Alistair. All you do is stand there smiling while you watch us struggle and fail. I don't know how you can enjoy all the suffering so much. <laughs> Just because you see a smile, don't think you know what's going on underneath. A smile is a valuable tool, my dear. It inspires your friends, keeps your enemies guessing, and ensures that no matter what comes your way, you're the one in control. Yes, fuck you, Alistair! <laughs> this is better than sex! have to disagree with you there. Radio's not dead, but it is ending this broadcast. <laughs> Bye, bitch. <laughs> we can do this. We'll be better. So redemption may take a while. We are sinners through their ledger. And we're doing it with a smile. speak now? You may. Alistair, pleasure to be meeting you, sweetheart. Quite a pleasure. Excuse my sudden visit, but I saw your fiasco on the picture show, and I just couldn't resist. What a performance! 
why I haven't been that entertained since the stock market crash of 1929. <laughs> so many orphans. Stop right there. God, we're on equal to better. I know your game. And I'm not gonna let you hurt anyone here, you pompous, cheesy talk show shit lord. Dear, if I wanted to hurt anyone here, I would have done so already. <laughs> So, does this mean that you think it's possible to rehabilitate a demon? <laughs> of course not! That's wacky nonsense! Redemption! Oh, the non-existent humanity! No, 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 no! I don't think there's anything left that could save such loathsome sinners! The chance given was the life they lived before! The punishment is this! There is no undoing what is done! So then, why do you want to help me if you don't believe in my cause? Consider it an investment in ongoing entertainment for myself! I want to watch the scum of the world struggle to climb up the hill of betterment, only to repeatedly trip and tumble down to the fiery pit of failure. I think everyone deserves a chance to prove they can be better, so I'm taking your offer to help. On the condition that there be no trickster voodoo strings attached. So it's a deal then? Shaking, no deals. <laughs> Smile, my dear. You know you're never fully dressed without one. <laughs> and what can you do, my effeminate fellow? I can suck your dick. Ha! Ah, no. Your loss. Well, this just won't do. I suppose I can cash in a few favors to liven things up. What the hell do you want with me this time? My friend, I am doing some charity work, so I took it upon myself to volunteer your services. I hope that's okay. Are you shitting me? Hmm. No, I don't think so. You thought it would be some kind of big fucking riot just to pull me out of nowhere? You think I'm some kind of fucking clown? Maybe. Inside of every demon is a lost cause. <laughs> but we'll dress them up for now with just a smile. Well, well, well. Look who it is harboring the striped freak. We meet yet again, Alistair. Do I know you? Oh, yes, you do. And this time I have the element of surprise. I'm so evil. Well, I'm starved. Who wants some jambalaya?